At 11 o'clock today, bells across Denver and across America tolled in remembrance of the Armistice Agreement. It was signed on this date 100 years ago, and it ended World War I. It took some TLC to get the bell here back in shape. Our Joel Hillen was there as the replica Liberty Bell across from the state capitol rang in honor of those who served. I think it just brings that spirit of love for this country and the freedom that we enjoy today. And I'd like to see that continue. Susan Donahue was regent for the Daughters of the American Revolution Mount Rosa chapter. When walking through Denver's Lincoln Park, she noticed the replica Liberty Bell and its plaques were in disrepair. I felt that it needed to be restored and back in working order again. So they went to work in 2011, raising $50,000. The bell was fully restored in 2014. As the snow fell Sunday morning, the bell was rung 21 times. It just brings back a lot of uh, thoughts about history, about the starting of this country, and uh, it's just very emotional. Among those who had the honor of ringing the bell was Richard Gensmer, a Vietnam veteran who served in the Navy. I just think of all the veterans, male and female, whether they were in combat or they served this country here in the States, they all gave part of their lives to support this country. And this bell represents the start of the country. And thanks to the Mount Rosa chapter of the DAR, each of us can pause and reflect. Understand that the bell symbolizes America's freedom and independence. In Denver, Joel Hillen, covering Colorado first. You know, each state was given a replica Liberty Bell in 1950 as part of a savings bond drive. Each is an exact replica of the famous bell at Independence Hall in Philadelphia.